add a little bit of some white. Trying to keep my hand out of the way. And the light color is a highlight and it makes everything come forward. I'm gonna bring in a little bit of a light purple. Almost looks close to the white color. Already on. There we go. <clears throat> I have a very creaky floor. So I'm gonna add a little bit more of this. A violet color. And I don't really have technical terms, I just do things. And I'm going to kind of put some of that darker violet color around the light color, almost like the paintbrush, is dancing. I'm going to drag the color down. There you go. Now, um, I'm going to use some of that violet color down here. If you're wondering what that noise is, that's Lucy. Just bring that over. Nice. <clears throat> so like I said in my last video, I use paper towel, a lot of paper towel. So as much paint as I put on the canvas, I also take it off. Um, so I, I waste a lot of paint, unfortunately. A lot, a lot of paint goes into my paper towel. Add a little bit of hmm, some magenta that I mixed up and um, I'm gonna put it here I'm gonna make a little rose over here just some little roses there's three there but I do the same over here Nice. <clears throat> then I'm going to add a little bit of white mixed with the purple. Um, and I'm going to go around where I did those roses. Pretty. Pretty. Nice. Lovely. Okay. Um, I'm liking that. So I'm going to put up a little bit more of this light highlight up into the rose pull the purple throughout, kind of take off what I have on my brush. There we go. Um, okay, I'm looking at this from back farther. Right here where it's dark, I'm going to add some of my signature polka dots. Some, for some reason, polka dots always end up in my artwork. So I'm going to add some here. Nice. I like that. Okay. Um, that looks good. I think I'll, I'll add a few polka dots just right here. to keep standing back. I can't very well, as I usually do because I'm holding onto the canvas, but usually I stand back and I take a look at it and see what I need to add. And the painting 
usually tells me what I need to add. It's almost like it's speaking to me. This is a lot of just spinning the paintbrush. Okay, I like that. I need to do something here. I'm not sure what yet. I think I'll put a little bit of the pink in. Or magenta. And I have to think what I want the background to look like. I'm going to add a little bit more of a highlight around where the, the roses are on the sides. There we go. Awesome. So I'll have to look at this one a little bit more. But while I've got you here, I'm going to sign my name. I always sign my name just Hamilton. I don't know why. I don't add the Laura, but maybe I'm lazy. I just add Laura. So I'm going to do that right now. I always put it in this bottom corner. So I start with my H. time a few years ago I actually was doing the hearts and I forgot the L and I had to go back and add it it was really funny okay there we go so there's one of the hearts for the series and I'm I'm liking it I'm gonna take another look later But now that I'm looking at it, I see I need to add a little bit of some turquoise in just right here, just a touch, a surprise. Awesome. I like it. 